come in. Can I help you? Hey, I'm the light brigade. I am here from your power company. You get flood water in here? No. I'm just doing some spring cleaning. I sent my walls and floors out to the dry cleaner. They should be back any minute. Hilarious. Listen, I have been working 16 hours a day since the storm. I don't got time for jokes. How high was the water? The water line was 4 feet. I already had an electrician in to rewire the first floor. Thank God I had them come the first week, because I hear it is impossible, to get any electricians to return your calls now. Are you here to tell me when the power is going to come back on? Four feet? Was your electrician licensed by the state of New York and did he give you a signed certificate with his license number stating he changed all the wiring down here? Uh. I think he was licensed. I found him in the street doing a job for one of my neighbors. I have the bill. He was here for two days and it cost me $2,000. Huh. So what you are saying is that you don't have a signed certificate from a licensed electrician to prove that all the wiring was redone? Well, you're from the power company. Please look around. You can see that all the wiring is new. That is not my job. My job is to pull the meter from anyone who does not present me with a signed, certified electrician's certificate. What do you mean by pull the meter? I mean pull the meter. So that your house does not get power from the pole. Until you fax us that certificate. Just as a precautionary measure so your house doesn't catch on fire. Why would my house catch on fire? I changed all the wiring that got wet. Look around. You can see I changed all the wiring that got wet. Are you a licensed electrician? Me? No, I am not. Why? Well because you just told me you changed all the wires. What you said was I changed all the wires. I can't trust your work if you're not the licensed electrician. By me, I meant, I hired an electrician. You are taking what I just said out of context. Then where is your signed certificate with your license number on it? I said I don't have one. But look around. There is all new wiring. How do you even know my original wiring was done by a licensed electrician? Look man, my house flooded too. I feel your pain. But I don't care about your original wiring. I just need to do my job. No cert, no meter. I am pulling your meter. I will leave a sticker where your meter used to be with a fax number on it where you can send a copy of your licensed electrician's signed certificate. Fax that, aunt. You will have a new meter delivered and installed within two to three business weeks after it is reviewed by the home office, and you've got Thanksgiving in there so probably longer. What? What if I can't get in touch with the electrician? How do I send a fax if I have no power? When is power coming back to the street? You should have power on the block next week. Well, not you but, probably everyone else. You won't have a meter when the power comes back up, so don't worry about the block. Worry about yourself. This is bullshit. Whatever. I need to get out of the stinky basement of yours. It smells terrible in here. I will be on the side of the house pulling your meter if you have any more questions. One last tip. Mister you should run some fans in here to help with the smell and to keep out the mold. This is not a basement. And how am I supposed to run fans if I have no power? Oh yeah right. Ha ha that's a good one. Man I need to get some sleep. Glad my house doesn't smell like this place. Good luck with everything. Whatever. Asshole. You big father mugging unshaved sloppy asshole. I heard that. I will note in your file that you are low priority. Okay asshole. What's the difference at this point anyway? You'll still be an asshole.